Is everything working? Are we live? I believe so. It looks like everything's working. Hopefully, because my internet has been quite, quite shit the past while. So, the past, like, day or two, my internet has not been good. But, over the next couple of weeks, my plan is to stream some of the big games of this year, you know. The big games that I missed, like, Dredge is the first one that comes to mind. And there are other indie games, Dave the Diver, which contentiously is an indie game, which... I'm not too sure about because, well, Dave the Diver is published by a massive publisher in Nexon, I believe. So, yeah. There's just loads of games that I missed this year that I kind of just want to get a taste for, taste of. And see if they deserve to be anywhere near that. Are they good? Are they amazing? Are they crap? Whatever it is. Dredge, I got a code for. Thanks to uh, the PR person at Team17 to give me that code. That was much appreciated. The only thing about Dredge, okay, and this is where this is going to be a very interesting stream. I don't like water. Well, I've not, I've not against water in real life. It's just water in games is very scary, as we all know. If you've watched this channel, Subnautica, it's the scariest game I've ever played. And while this game is a first person, it's sort of an isometric game and you're on a boat. So it shouldn't be as scary. You're still on water and it still sort of has that sort of a... Uh, cosmic horror kind of thing going so yes we're just gonna have to wait and see can i actually play this game that's the real question this was a game i was saving to play with my playstation portal which fingers crossed i'll be able to get tomorrow and if so i will be playing a lot of games on the portal to test it out and i'm not just going to be playing normal single player games i want to really put the portal to the test see if it's actually any better than the steam deck because i stream my steam deck quite a bit and I stream my PlayStation to my Steam Deck, should I say, quite a bit. And it works out pretty well for me. Uh, honestly, it works out very well for me. So I'm hoping the portal will either match or improve that experience. And maybe in the right conditions, I will be able to play sort of multiplayer games. Not very competitively, but kind of casually on the PlayStation portal. But that's enough about the PlayStation portal because we are talking about Dredge today. Uh, this game, I think, is up for both debut indie game and best indie game the morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit upright you're lying cold you're lying cold oh wait you are lying on the cold wet dock where you collapsed the night before a short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from boat nearby nearby the man knows you welcome to the great marrow i must say quite a dramatic first impression i see you're already introduced to the jagged rocks along the bay do you not see the lighthouse it was shining right at you oh well i'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out, catch some fish, see if you can fill your cargo while you're getting your bearings with the light. Finally, I suppose I don't need to say this, but get back before sundown, before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. So, I don't really know much about this game. I've seen a couple of clips on Twitter, etc., etc. And that is uh, all I've seen. I know it definitely has some sort of horror vibes to it. So we're just going to have to wait and see. Let's do some fishing. And it also has a Resident Evil style uh, inventory system, which is absolutely brilliant. Okay, so what do I have to do here? I have to... Yeah, cool. Oh, and then you have to do the inventory management. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, so we'll place you. Start fishing. Oh, blue mackerel. Okay, now I have to... Let's actually... Can I start moving? Crap, no. I wonder how much I can fish. Oh, that just speeds it up. Okay. Disturb water. Stock low. I wonder... Should I be, like, keep fishing? Is there, like, an overfishing policy in this place? We shall see, anyway. Okay, it's depleted. Okay, so maybe... Maybe I was overthinking that. Maybe, you know, you can just keep fishing to your heart's content. So far, this game isn't scary. Uh, we'll have to wait and see what it's like once I get to night time because I'm not looking forward to that. But yeah, what's everyone's opinion or thoughts on sort of the, the game of the year nominations? I know there's been there's been quite a bit of controversy over it. A lot of people open arms over certain things. As you know, it's the gaming industry. So of course, people will be open arms about stuff that realistically don't matter. And they never will matter. Because it's just games at the end of the day. Even though, like, this is literally my job. 
Still only games at the end of the day. Time only advances when you're moving, fishing, or other specific actions. Okay, thank you. What's this over here? Firstly, the one thing I fucking absolutely adore the art style of this game. This is... This is a gorgeous, gorgeous looking game. I actually wonder if it's up for any art direction thing. Message in a bottle. Oh, so I have a tiny little light. What does this uh, light? Spyglass, foghorn, cool. Okay. You don't have the right equipment. Okay, so I can't take up any sharks, which is disappointing. I'd love to catch a shark. But I know, like, out of all those sort of indie games, I think the ones that kind of entice me the most are... I think... See, Viewfinder looks interesting to me because... I think... Uh, I know Tom reviewed it at Game Explain, and I think he thought it was, like, just... It was an okay game. Like, nothing absolutely fantastic about it, but it's up for a nomination anyway. I know it had some cool ideas, but I'm not really a big fan of... Uh, I'm not a big fan at all of sort of uh, puzzle games. Puzzle games just don't do it for me, and I don't think they ever will. Uh, in, in all my reviews and games that have puzzles, if my level of puzzles is, yes, it has the right levels of puzzles when I'm not bashing my head against the wall, but also it doesn't make me feel too dumb, you know? I think the, the less puzzles I have in my games, the better. But other than that, let me actually, let me just dock here. Uh, video, let me look up. The Game Awards. What else is on the indie thing? Because as I said, over the next couple of next couple of weeks, I'm going to uh, I'm going to look up. I'm gonna play some of the games that I haven't. I've played a lot of the games. So let's see. Uh, vote now. I understand you may not have necessary funds. Okay, he's alone. So this guy is like Tom Nook. He is the Tom Nook of this game. So until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. Small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So to recap, you'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt, and in turn, keeping the population fed is satisfied. Understand? Yes. Okay, best independent game. Let's see. What do we have here? Best independent game. Cocoon. That is a puzzle game, which I don't like. Uh, Dredge, which I'm playing now. Sea of Stars, like, to be honest, uh, I, Sea of Stars is one of the best games I've played all year, so I think Sea of Stars might take that cake. Unless this game turns out to be absolutely amazing. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised you found the new one so fast. What happened to the other one? He, it takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay, I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more too. Other towns on other islands might pay you different. But while you are still got your debt outstanding here, it suggests your work paying off first. Okay, let's see. Okay, you can have all my fish. Okay, so he takes money off the debt. What does the gold mean? Oh, it's the size. Okay, so he's an extra big boy. Nice. Cool, return to town. The mayor is standing outside the fishmonger store. Excellent work. I've no doubt you're, you'll be able to provide for this town. Look, here, I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you could make something out of it. Why don't you take it? What is it? Research part. A curious looking component could be used to develop new equipment, but would need some investigation first. Okay. Well, we'll plop you in here. Oh, one last thing. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. Okay, cool. I'm enjoying how fast this is. There's no messing around, no stupid tutorials. It just gets you straight into it. Oh, I got a trophy as well. Must be the new fisherman. I can make new improvements here. Improvements? What the feck was that word? And everything takes some time to install. Okay. Damage. You can patch it up. She shrugs and gestures. Grand, grand. Take a look. Okay. I want something. Rusty onboard engine. That improves my speed. How much money? I have $121 do dues. I don't think I need new lights. Uh... A simple skimmer. A lightweight rod suited to catching fish that live in the shallows. A small pool makes for limited reeling speed, however. Hmm. I think... We'll go with the fish. We'll go with... I, I, I am a fisherman. So, maybe... Uh, being able to fish more is probably the way to go. 
My storage. Cool. What's this? Research. Hydraulic rod mechanically assisted reels allow the catching of significantly larger species. Uh, engines. Okay, I think we'll just we'll just get us because I don't think moving fast is going to change much. I think it's mostly just getting as many fish in as possible. Cabin. Messages. Morning of the second day of the honeymoon and our first day proper. Today we're sailing around the islands and inlets at the back of the Great Marrow. I love the rocks here. The layers and colours are so striking. Furthermore, the fishing is relatively poor in these shallows, so I know so I know he will keep his hands on the wheel instead of the rods. He renamed the boat last night Julie. He did a fancy renaming ceremony and everything. I think he took that more seriously than the wedding. Supposedly, it's very important to perform it correctly, lest you want ill fortune to follow your vessel. He wanted to throw away everything with the old name in it, but I kept the keychain. Ocean's, Rich Ocean's Riches was a good name. I think he has prepared a surprise picnic lunch. I can see the basket half hidden, stuffed under a blanket at the front of the cabin. I love when he tries to be romantic. Cool. There we go. Encyclopedia. This gives me all my fish. Oh, well, there's a lot of areas and a lot of different type of fish. There's 150. Oh, my God. They're going for a Pokemon thing. Okay. Now, I assume I go rest. I don't think I want to go. I assume there will be scary shit in the water once I go out at night time. And the longer I can go away, I can go without seeing them, the better. So I guess I just have to keep going and pay off that debt. That debt won't actually take too long to pay off, to be honest. It literally nearly have it paid off. But this game is awfully tranquil. Very, very pleasant experience to play, I'd imagine. Until she hits the fan. I've seen some tentacles in the water on clips on Twitter. And that's what, that's what I'm not looking forward to. Oh, that's very... Oh, that's... Okay. That was a bit confusing. Okay, so I have to learn how to maximize my space. I love Resident Evil-style inventory systems. There was actually a game that... Oh, I forget the name of it, but... I know I got an email about it in my inbox. And the whole game was actually about... Sort of like a Resident Evil-style... Inventory management game. You don't have the right equipment. Oh, I thought I did. I thought I... Oh, no, it takes time, doesn't it? I wonder if that two in-game hours or two real hours. Okay, well, that was just another fish that I caught. Okay. I'd say maybe one more day of fishing and I'll have my debt paid off. I'm like Animal Crossing where you're there for like 20 years trying to pay it off. Because Tom Nook is an absolute scumbag. Just taking all your money. Okay, time goes by pretty fast. Which is the complete opposite of what Madonna said. Is this going to hurt me? We'll find out. No, okay. Shapes in the deep. You don't have the right equipment. Okay, thank you. Doesn't seem like I have the right equipment for basically anything. Which is no bueno. Wonder what's over at that town. I guess I'll go over. I'll have enough time, won't I? Let's see. I shall fish anyway. Loads of fish. Fish are friends, not food. There was a, a really cool indie game announced at the uh, that direct thing that was on. It's, it's a, a Scottish game. And it's really cool because Scotland and Ireland have fairly similar, like, fairly similar geographically as in the, you know, what they look like, you know, the rocks and all this. So it was nice to see something that looked, resembled what I, you know, what, what's around me. Okay, start fishing. This looks like these fish will be too big to fit in my inventory. Yes, I knew it. What can I get rid of? Because this is kind of making things awkward. Let's see. Oh, crap. Uh, oh. Uh, yeah, put you around there. Grab. Oh, I know, I know. We can grab you. See, I guess. And then I could probably put you there. And then. No, I think I'm just like moving things around aimlessly here. Potentially, yeah. Unless. No. Ah, feck. I want to pick them up. Uh, I guess I can. 
discard you and discard you. That'll give me enough room. Because this this boy takes up a lot of a lot of room. And we can place you here. Okay, well it's probably getting dark anyway, so. I don't want to risk anything right now. But this game looks fantastic. Might I add, I'm very slow. I drank a can of coke before I started streaming. And I'm burping and hiccuping. And I ate my dinner as well, so. Probably wasn't the best idea. But we move, as the kids say. Oh, see, I'm so used to playing the Switch. I, geez, that's the first time that has ever happened to me. I pressed X as if I was on the Switch and not on the PlayStation. I've had a special order come through from a customer. You can fulfill it. I'll pay you above normal prices. Tell me about the order. One gold flounder and one grey eel. I think I have them. Yes, I do. I, uh, that's That's quite surprising, isn't it? There you go. You can have your gold flounder and you can also have your grey eel. And I think that's my debt paid off now. A little more curious. They want a couple of squid and a whole black grouper. Don't see many people fishing squid these days. They only feed at night. And well, you know what things are like at night around here. I don't know. <laughs> and I don't think I really want to find out either. But for anybody watching, I did get a code for this. I'm not very well. I should be well versed, but I'm not. In the... Oh no, I still have more. I'm not very well versed in the... Sort of... Legalities behind doing everything. and Sort of, if you get me. Uh, we'll install you. Oh wait, can I only have one engine in? No, 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 no. We'll refund you. Okay, so I get my money back anyway. But I'm not well versed in the legalities behind... What I should and shouldn't disclose on if I have everything or what I got shit for. I probably should be. But yes, I got a code for it. I think that covers my arse anyway. Because I think it's different when you're streaming it or something. I'm not sure. Okay, but I don't have any more research parts. I guess I'll just rest. Or, no, 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 no. A hunched woman approaches you from the steps of the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern. Invisible. Why are you here? I've come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. She turns and shuffles along the path and leads you to the light. How does one speak to the mayor? mayor. This is the person I was hoping to see. You'll be sailing out east towards Little Barrow. Would you give this package to the dock worker there, please? Yes. The mayor hands you a small damn package bound on the string. It's dripping slightly. The dock worker will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick. I don't want it to spoil. Oh, okay. Map. So it's out there. Okay, so that's that little place that I saw. Okay, that's good. I know where I have to go anyway. Deliver the package to Arrow Squid. Cool. Have the package in my cargo, don't they? I? I do. No, I don't. Oh, jeez, that would have been bad. Uh, two cargo. Yes. Do I go out at night? Do I risk it? That's the real question. What, what exactly do I need? Pursuits. Two arrow squid. I need to catch two squid. The only bite at night. Ah, do you know what? Let's go. Oh no, already. Already it's gotten creepy. The music has stopped. <laughs> oh, I really don't like this. This genuine... I, I'm not like... I'm genuinely... I am not putting this on. I hate this. I've always hated water in games. Like, even like Jolly Roger Bay and all that Mario 64. I couldn't beat them. Like, I, ju I simply just could not beat them when I was a kid. It, ju it, it, it genuinely makes my skin crawl. And I don't know why. Because I'm not afraid of the water in real life. I'll go out on boats. I'll go swimming in the sea. 
I'll do it all, but when it comes to games, I don't know why. Now, I'm sure if I was doing, like, deep sea diving, you know, that might creep me out a bit. But... Yeah. Well, you can just have the squid, okay? You you just take them for now. Yeah, you can take them. And then I'll sell you this one squid. And then I'll go to sleep, okay? That was... That was, that was a bit... That was a bit less scary than I thought, but it's still unsettling. And this is only the first day. So we go over here to deliver this package here anyway. Do you know what? I'm actually just going to shut up and let you soak in this because this is cool. Is there any other indie games anybody has played this year that I think I should uh, should give a, like give a proper go before the end of the year? Because I think I've done a fairly de I've done a decent ish job this year of playing indies as well as main games. So, but just if there's like one or two that I'm like, yeah, it's like oh, you have to play them. Like you're really missing out if you don't play this. Okay, let's deliver this package to. The dock worker here. They might actually buy flounders off me more or for more money. Mm. Yeah, nice and fresh. They'll do nicely. I'm to pay you, of course, and you some money. I was given this all book a few weeks back, but it didn't make much sense to me. You'll surely get more use out of it. He pulls a crumpled book from his back of his pocket and gives it to you a number of the pages are folded over. Keep it in your cabin, perhaps. You can read it while you're on the water. Stop by for chat anytime. I know how lonely you can be. Right, let's see. Let's go to the trader. What does the trader want? Hello. Is that? No. Ah. I don't believe we've met. Forgive me, my eyes. Or what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinket. Cool. Well, I don't have any special trinkets. I have some flounders. And I don't really think that that's considered a special trinket. So I'm guessing I'll just catch some small fish. Just that I'm maximizing my time out on the water. I can probably fit two of these in, maybe? Let's see. Okay, so the stock is low. So I can pop you there. Oh, it's already depleted. What? We go over here anyway. Fill up my inventory and go back. And then my debt... Oh, I don't think the debt will be fully paid off, but... I'll certainly be close. These are only the, the two square guys. But I'm telling you... Resident Evil inventory systems make every single game more... More useful. Well, you maybe call it... Would you call it a Deus Ex? Well, I wonder what the first game was to have an inventory system like this. The first game I ever played that had an inventory system like this was Deus Ex Human Revolution. Because, and I bring them up a lot, Total Biscuit got me into it. And Total Biscuit was probably the most influential person on me having a YouTube channel and being deeply, deeply invested in games. Okay, well there we go. We have that. Now I just need to get that big feckin' big boy fish thing from... Uh, at night time. But that means I have to go out at night, which I'm not too happy about. And it also means that I probably have to go out deeper because they weren't in the little shallow ponds. And I don't want to have to deal with that. Because, you know, there's going to be some fucking... Like, look at that eyeball up the top. What does that mean? Who's watching me? Obviously, this is sort of, I guess, Lovecraftian horror, I guess. Would that be right? Am I right in saying that? Sort of, uh... Sell, 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 sell. sell. Squids and all that crap. That's a little crafty, isn't it? The mayor is walking quickly towards you. Seems to be in a good mood. With spring in his step. Fantastic news. Thanks partly to your efforts. Greater Marrow was growing. The town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. In fact, I've granted a consent from the shipwright to expand the facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. I've also allocated some money to improve the fishmonger service. He might have something to talk to you about soon. Cool. Keep up the good work. We're glad you've chosen to be here with us. Or whatever the fact you said. Dry dock. 
Significant improvements to my vessel, extra space, more attachment points for equipment, and even superior hulls. Okay, cool. Oh, so that's what that wood was in the water. Cool. Nice. The only thing is, let me see. I did upgrade my weighted line. No, I did upgrade that. Didn't I? Hydraulic rod. I don't have anything for that. So, plus 10 knots. And what's this? Plus 14 knots. But it's not... Hmm. Let me see. I need, I need to figure something out here. Can I, like, grab... Can I uninstall this? Ah, yeah. And then I can maximize the space here a bit better. It takes two hours to install it. How? And what's two hours? Is that two in-game hours? I don't think it is. Then we'll install the new engine, which will make me move faster. Cool. Now, 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 now. Cabin. Select an active book to pass the time. Pass time to read. Okay. Pursuits. So I need one black grouper. So I need to go out. Do I want to go out though? That's the real question. The answer to that question is no. Will I go out? I will. Oh, there we go. Turn on my little light. I don't like this. Okay, just... It's only a game. It's only a game. Nothing can hurt me. Nothing here can actually deal damage to me. Okay, fish, 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 fish. Oh, no, I messed up. Oh, yeah, squid. Just keep fishing. Yep, cool. Just keep, just keep fucking fishing. Oh, nothing's around me. Absolutely nothing is here to scare me. No. Okay, that's cool. That's, that's, that's nice to know. Oh, no, no, no. Now my light's going out. Oh, shit. You really cannot see. Oh, my God. I nearly fucking ran into that thing. What's lighting up over here? There's something. I have to be careful here. I don't want to crash. Damage in my boat. Lighthouse towers above you. Rage crash endlessly. Kill all creatures. Human or otherwise would have their brittle bodies broken. Okay, dead. Are you the guy that I'm looking for? <gasps> yes. I got them. Say these boys sell for a lot of money. There we go. Okay, I survived. This game isn't scary. This game isn't scary. Wait. Just wait. It's like even games like... Uh, what's the name of it? Sea of Thieves. Yeah, that's, I was like... I, I couldn't think of the name. Sea of Thieves. Even that now. now has some creepy stuff in it. When all the cracking tentacles come out and all, it's like, oh, no, no, I don't like that. I do have fish for that order. There you go, my good sir. Black grouper for you. Give me loads of money. Yeah, I do have it in me, man. Oh, cool. So I, I can now deploy a crab pot. Don't forget. Oh, cool. Do I have to buy them? A hundred quid. That's a lot for a crab, for a crab cage. No, let me sell. I want to sell to you. Oh, wait, no. That, okay, no, okay. I'm just being stupid. Nothing new there. So we need to get some materials next. I don't really think I can do any upgrades. Do you know what? We'll repair. I have my engines all sorted. I 
I think the next thing I need is this boy. The hydraulic rod, which I will save up for. So, where am I supposed to put the crab pot? Do I need, like, the deeper the better? Or, or what's the story? We go, crab pot. And we'll deploy it. Okay, so we, we know where my crab pot is, anyway. Do I just have to keep, like, fishing all these small guys first? Just to get my... You know, just, just to get a bit of, a bit of stuff. Because, to be honest, I don't want to go any further out than I have to. At this moment of time. Because I don't really know what's out there. Nor do I think I can actually fish for any of the crap, you know, that's actually there. Do you know what? No. I think I know how to maximize the space now. Because I don't think I can pick up these this wood yet. You don't have... No, I can't. So I think I just have to, like... Don't crash. Okay, good. I didn't crash. So I think I just have to keep picking up some crap first. So I get the weighted rod. Maybe the weighted rod lets me pick up the wood in that. And then that's... That's the plan. Once that hits, anyway. Fish. See, because I think now I have it. Uh, why isn't it? Jeez, these things are getting depleted very fast. I think I'm overfishing. Because I don't think I can capture you. No. Okay, just keep fishing, just keep fishing. Nothing around here can hurt me yet. Yes is the big word. I'm not looking forward to the first time that I see something, but... Twist you around, nice. There. That's enough for now. Can I rest in here? Is this even a dock? It is. But what's over here? Okay, I can rest here, nice. Ruined mansion, the door is locked. Okay, well. Workshop, did workshop looks... So it hasn't been used in decades. Go inside. It's locked. Well, that's not much use, is it? Let's rest. Hope nothing can, like, damage me out here since I'm not technically in the port. Well, nothing happened. So back to the port we go. I can sell my stuff. That'll probably take me up to be able to get the next rod, which... I can then probably start to fish those sharks and get the wood as well so I can start upgrading. But this game is going to be absolutely perfect for my PlayStation Portal. I can see, I'm hoping that I'm getting it tomorrow. I've been on a big massive, there's a big massive saga over it on whether or not I was actually going to get it because of just, it, it isn't being sold, it, it's only being sold by two places over here. And the way they're selling it is really weird. I found this book out back could be useful to you. Cool. The way they're selling it over here is weird because in every single other country, PlayStation have the PlayStation Direct store. So like, you know, in, you know, there's PlayStation Direct Germany, England, France, but all of them only deliver to their own country. And Ireland are in a weird spot because... Ooh, now I kind of have to start thinking about things. Simple skimmer. A lightweight rod suited for catching fish that live in shallow, small pools, make for limited reeling power. Okay, so I think... Oh, so now we kind of have to start dancing around what I want to... What I want to use. Okay, I like this. So then I can't catch anything coastal now. So I can just uninstall you and put, put you in storage for now. And now go over to my storage. I'll continue my story about uh, the PlayStation Portal now in two seconds. So the PlayStation Portal over here isn't being sold because Ireland are in a weird spot where 
for years, even though Irish people would not want this, Ireland were grouped under the same category as England, as in when it came to, it was always the UK and Ireland store for whatever. But they have, ever since Brexit, it doesn't work that way because now we aren't, you know, they're not in the EU, so we have to play customs on stuff. So half the time things no longer deliver from England to Ireland the way they used to, which is really annoying, but, you know, what can you do? But now, like, there's no PlayStation store, there's no PlayStation Ireland direct store. So Curry's, who are, I think, an English retailer of tech and stuff, are selling it. But it, it's kind of weird where it's on their website, but it isn't on their website. Like, it's it's showing up on their website, but you, you, you've you never been given the chance to pre-order or order it. It just says it's out of stock. And then there's another place called... Well, it's called Very Now, but it used to be called Little Woods. And they are the same, where it's on their website, but it's been out of stock. So now I'm just kind of waiting. I can order from Amazon Germany, but that means it won't be here to, like very late like i think friday or saturday at the latest which kind of annoying but what can you do so yeah that's 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 the current predicament that i'm in it's hardly a predicament i guess it's a uh... okay well, we got one crab no i didn't mean to pick it up feck we drop that okay now let's see can i pick up this wood and can i get those big sharks as well I assume I can pick up this wood now. You don't have the right equipment. Then what the fuck do I need? Oh, I need a dredge. And that's oceanic and I have shallow. Okay. Well, if only I read, then I would actually know. That would have made sense. Let's see. Yes, I can get the sharks. I say these are worth fair, fair bit of money. And they also take up a fair bit of inventory space. I'll probably only get like two of these in my inventory at a go. Well. Okay. And that's more... Stuff. Yeah, dredge. So it's dredge that I need. And I probably can't even fish you. Oh no, I can't. I have shallow. I don't even think I have room for you. No, there's no four squares. Because of these feckin' sharks. They're like a really awkward shape. Aha! We don't want to tempt fate. Back we go. Playing the slow game here. And those books seem to give me stat, stat increases as well. It also said for me to go south. <laughs> so, fishmongers. I do have, I have a single crab. I don't have the big boy, though. Oh, that is a big boy. Look at the size of that claw. Pop you over there. Done. Probably worth my while getting a couple of crab things, is it? How much is the shark? Ooh, the sharks are worth good money. Basic crab pot. Basic crab pot. Okay, so I wonder if I just start placing... Well, I can only buy two, so we get two crab pots going. I can get them out before the end of the day as well. But there's absolutely no reason for me to... To not just put the crab pots here, is it? Because I don't think the, the actual crabs that I can catch change. Or maybe they do, I don't know. Find that out, but that plenty symbol hasn't changed, so I'll just drop them out there and we'll see. We go resting anyway. There might be a crab in this pot already. Hopefully one of the big boys. Check pot. No. There's only one day remaining on that one. No 
and we rest. We'll rest till morning. It is now morning. Okay, so I don't think I have any money to do anything. I can't really, really do anything, can I? Fishmongers, cabin. Encyclopedia, there's gonna be the shark. Oh, now. We got no money. Oh, so I should really be talking to random people because they give you good stuff. Oceanic, shallow, shallow. Okay, so shallow, shallow, coastal. And I need trawling or whatever the red, the blue one was. Or brown one, I think was the color. Dry dock, yes. I can't pick up anything. So I need the, the new fishing rod. And where did the mayor want me to go? I don't know where the mayor... He said go south, didn't he? How does one bring up the map? Map. Over there is where he wanted me to go, maybe. If only I read what he was saying to me. Because I've already been there and I said I couldn't do anything. But maybe that's just because... I... wasn't, like, in that part of the story yet. We'll undock anyway and we'll go... Might be, maybe, hopefully, one of the big boys in the crab thing. Oh, yes. No, I didn't want to... Crap, I keep... I keep picking them up by accident. Oh, a trophy one. Nice. Nice cock. That was one of my favorite memes. It just came out of the blue. And it just made no sense. But I think they're the best memes, to be honest. When they don't make any sense. A floating boy. Yeah, that's only a little small boy. Okay, so let's go over here and see. See, can I find anything? I don't think I have room for a shark, do I? There's something glowing over there. I think I do have room for a shark. I'll fit him in. Uh. God damn it. You can barely even fit in the in the box. I'm trying to okay. Maximize the space here. Can I fit the shark? He can go down here. Now. I like how he jiggles. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. East? I thought you meant weast. There's my Spongebob reference for today. I don't think I ever really got a day without referencing Spongebob to some extent. Okay, another... 21st of August, 1927. So this is an old, old game. Like, do I have a crab thing? No, I don't. I don't have a coastal thing. Okay, so maybe he was telling me to go here. Because, I mean, the next thing south is all the way down there. I don't think I can make it there in one day. I'm getting eaten by something out in the water. Yeah, the door's locked. It's locked again. So I don't know what he was actually asked. Unless. Well, we'll find out. Maybe if I go to this rest and then go down south, I'll be able to make it in one day without, you know, getting night time and scaring the shit out of me. That is a that is a possibility anyway. Any more curbs? No. I think this one needs to be picked up, doesn't it? I don't think I have any room, though. Or repaired, even. Needs repair. Pick up. Oh, I do have room. I 
Let me actually read the message. 21st of August, we had a slight accident yesterday around the shallows at the back of the Greater Marrow. A rock seemingly appeared out of nowhere, struck the front of the boat, it did not penetrate the hull, but it jostled us around a few times, fell overboard into the water. We did not see what they were, which is of some concern, but we believe all important articles are accounted for. He has been checking over some notes from the boat, renaming ceremony, he's paranoid that he performed steps incorrectly. Okay, well this is a... Uh, creepy and there's something something's going on and it's more than likely got to be a big tentacled monster that'd be my guess anyway fishmonger yes i do have the crabs i think i'll just give you the normal one because i'll probably won't get as much money so you can have that that'll do Glad you got some use out of the old pot. You can always buy more here or repair the damaged ones at the shipyard. There's something else I wanted to. No, forget it. All right, pal. Okay, so I can repair that and put that back out. Does that repair the crab box? Or crab pot? It does. But like... I can't feckin... So that's shallow, that's shallow, that's oceanic, and that's coastal. So I think I need coastal. Wait, but I have the weighted line, don't I? No, that's a simple skimmer. Aha! So that's what I need, is it? Feck, I think I just wasted money on that. Ah, sure. Be grand, be grand, be grand. It'll be fine. I can't actually put that in because I have the hydraulic rod. So that's oceanic. But I want shallow. But do I... Uh, I think I just wasted money. Because that's also shallow, isn't it? It just... That one... That one's faster. That's not what I want. Okay, we're heading south. We're gonna rest. And unless I could speak to the mayor and I didn't see it, let's see. What can I do for you? Nah, do you know what? Feck you. I don't wanna speak to you. We're going down south. Down south we go. Okay, well, there's, I don't need to do anything with them. I can leave them. Don't get caught up fishing, all right? Feck. Uh, let me put down the crab paw here. Cool. Okay, another crab in there. Do we go to that island, maybe? Don't know. He said go south. And I'm going to rest till dawn here. Because I don't think I'll make it out there. And I don't want to find out what will happen. But I guess at some point I will have to find it out. Figure out what it <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Just crashed into the wall. Okay, now. It's raining. Now, do you know where we go? We'll go over here. This looks like a, a spot that I can actually make it to. Ah, guitar player, welcome. And thank you very much for the $2. I appreciate that. That will uh, go towards something. My next game. Because I buy a lot of games. But welcome, guitar player. It's actually been a while, hasn't it? Any cool fish here? Well, I need coastal stuff, which I don't have. So I can definitely make it out there, which is at least positive. 
Let's see what's over here at this dock. Oh, oh what is what? You approach a hooded figure, a swathed in dark blue robes, her face is barely visible. Fisherman, please help. You can barely hear the rasping whisper above the wind and waves. Fulfill the hunger. The hooded figure unfurls an old paper scroll. He points it to a shape. Okay, so you need a, a blue mackerel. Okay. Well, that's not ominous at all, is it? Not at all. <laughs> so I need a blue mackerel. The only thing is, I don't think I have the right fishing rod for it. Because I think these guys are going to be mackerel here. They are, but I need a coastal rod. Okay, well, I'll have to go back to the base, so. See if I can catch a couple of fish on the way. Okay, well, they look friendly. They're only big dolphins. I thought they were seagulls. That's what I thought I heard. But they weren't. They're big giant dolphins that seem to be friendly. And I hope they stay that way. Yeah, they're coastal as well. Guitar player, any interest in this game? Have you ever heard of it? It's uh, up for best indie game and the game awards. And it's also up for best debut indie game. Or best debut game, I think. I don't think it's specifically debut indie game. There's probably something around the back of the island as well I could, I could explore. But so far, the game isn't scary, but I know it has sort of horror e vibes, you know, sort of a Lovecraftian horror kind of kind of thing, which I'm not too uh, not too fond of whatsoever, but. I've loads of crab cage crab pots out that I need to catch crabs. <laughs> catch crabs. <laughs> oh my child. Oh no, I don't like the look of you. Ew. That is very Lovecraftian. I don't like that. I don't like that whatsoever. Yeah, there's a couple of games in it. I wanna I wanna check them out over next over the coming weeks. Just check out I, like Sea of Stars is up there. Sea of Stars is one of the best games I've uh, I've played all year, so. <sighs> Delicately patterned handkerchief. Well I've seen this before. I'll give you this thing. I'll pay for your fish too, of course. The first corrupted fish. Okay. That's a bit weird, isn't it? Ah, I'd say... Okay, I know who wants to buy that off me anyway. A man is looking at you through the cabin window. His face is mostly in shadow. I know what you took to the fish monger. I'll be clear. I know he extracted an artifact from it. and needs to inspect it, but not here. Meet me on Blackstone Isle. Head out this bay and cut south. I have a business proposition. I'll be waiting. Okay, Blackstone Isle is the next place I need to go. Yeah, cool, guitar player. Thank you. Thanks for stopping, boy. Uh, I'll be streaming again soon enough, so. Enjoy your work. Okay, so we repaired the crab pot anyway. So I need coastal. Okay, where's my coastal rod? Storage. Shallow coastal. No, I don't want to discard it. I want to install it. Let me just... Oh, I can't... Uh, I kind of wish I could keep them in storage. That would probably be good. Okay, well, you... So, I know where I need to go next, anyway. Pursuits. I need a blackstone oil, and I need to get the blue mackerel as well. So, map. 
Okay, so that, okay, that's where I need to go. And while I'm there, I'll ca catch a blue mackerel and I'll go over and I'll talk to that weird creepy hooded guy. I'm not hopeful for what will happen when I speak to him and give him what he wants, but... I mean, if he sends out some weird tentacle thing that's got... Like, what is that thing over there? Like, what's that red thing in the background up in the sky? That's obviously leading me to some place. Some place where I don't want to go. Okay, the crab pots. I can pick them up on the way back. I actually have a crab pot to put down, don't I? Yep. So the crab pots seem to be a nice way just to keep... Keep a bit of money flowing in, you know? Okay, blue mackerel. This looks like blue mackerel. I'll catch a couple just in case he wants a couple. I know he said he only wants one, but you never know. Plus, they don't take up much inventory space. Lovely. Okay, yeah, we go with tree blue mackerel. Then we go over to creepy robe person McGee. And we'll see what he wants. Or what he gives us. Hopefully it's something good. Hopefully it's not something that will scare the absolute bejesus out of me, but we'll figure that we'll we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. So far, this game is very engrossing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love these. Uh, I don't know. It's fishing. I always, I've always loved fishing games. I've always loved Resident Evil inventory style management or Deus Ex inventory management. Whatever you want to call it. Also, there's a very cool atmosphere that is both tranquil and creepy. Without expert precision, they plunge their hands through the gullet of the fish and tear out the heart. They stuff it into their mouth unceremoniously, more still empty. They point to another shape on a second scroll. I don't think I have that fish. A tiger mackerel. No, I don't. Okay, well, this guy just wants mackerel all day. Are you tiger mackerel? No. He's tiger woods instead. But um, a... I wouldn't even call that a joke. It was that bad. Sure, you don't come to this channel for comedy, I'll tell you that much. And if you do come to, come to this channel for comedy, then I think uh, that's no bueno. Is this going to be the tiger mackerel that I need? No, I wonder. I'll just keep fishing. Let's see. Blue mackerel. I mean, I'm, you know, we can just sell them at the end of the day. <gasps> grotesque mackerel. Ew. I'd say that dude might want, want the grotesque mackerel. Blue mackerel. Blue mackerel. It's getting dark. No, get me back to a feckin' place. Swim, you feckin' fecker. Okay, just, just keep swimming, as Dory said. Dory's gonna keep me... Keep me sane here. Technically not swimming, I'm sailing. But as I said, this does gen this sort of crap genuinely makes my skin crawl. And I'm and I'm not even I'm I'm not putting it on. I'm not really one to you know fake all these reactions and all that. It's just very creepy. Okay, let's talk to this dude. We'll dock and see what, what is here. The man is standing in a doorway, watching you approach. He's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in crimson with silver ribbons. You came, good or good, allow me to introduce myself. I'm a collector of many things. Art and artifacts, treasures and truths, and curios. Curios? I've never really heard that. I occupy the periphery of desire. And you have something for me. You give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up to the flickering light and studies it. These patterns are unmistakable, even after all this time. This handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. It carried items of great importance, as you can imagine, retrieving them is proving to be challenging. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge the wrecks and dark depths. I don't want to do that. Find me these lost relics and I'll reward you in many ways. Hmm. 
dredge crane a ring a necklace a watch a music box and a key i would encourage you to ask around the towns about shipwrecks or other strange occurrences anything might be worth investigating return when you have something i will never have anything it's not something i want to i want to even try to invest in, even though i will because i'm genuinely i am enjoying this very much Okay, is this more depth? I need to get that macro. I don't think I'll be able to, though. Coastal. Well, I don't think I'll be able to find them in a coastal thing, will I? No. Class. Need to catch a tiger mackerel next. That's the next plan. But I'll go back and I'll sell some stuff and then I'll start swimming out a bit more. As I say, if I just keep fishing at that pool, I will eventually get a tiger mackerel. Because that's what it seems to be. Maybe there's like different... Different chances of it all being dropped. Take all... Cool. Three more crops. Yeah, this should be a lot of money. I should probably keep this weird fish, though. Builder, you approach a woman sitting on the dockside, staring out the sea. She turns to you. What's it like out there? It's peaceful. I can't go back. She's gazing out the sea. Say... Uh, I must really move. There's an island. There's an island. I've heard about Steel Point just to the north. Two units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need. Well, I need to be able to get a rod that I can use to collect stuff, but I can't. What is it? There's a spot at the back of the gr at the back of Greater Marrow where a current carries in wreckage from seas. Okay, some nights you can see an unnatural glow. But I don't want it. I don't want to see that. Now let's sell some crap. They go mad. Well, perhaps, but I want to know for sure. Bring me a mutant fish. Annie will do. Just keep this between the two of us. Yes, I do have a mutant fish. There you go, mate. You can have that. Average fish from you. He clutches it close to his chest, wringing his hands around its slimy body. Yes, this should do nicely. Oh, yes! Research parts. Thank you. They will come in very handy. Silence. In this stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguished. Please sell what you need, then leave. Mm. This is very mysterious. There, you can have all the mackerel. I don't really need it. But now I can actually start upgrading crap. No, I can't. It's not this menu. It's the other menu. Shipwright. What is that menu? Oh, research. Oh, the flexible fishing rod does both mangrove. Engines? So you take one and you take two. I think... Oh, no, you do take two as well. Improved engine, efficient crab pot, hardy crab pot, large crab pot. I think that, that rod's probably the way to go, is it? Now available in stores. I probably can't buy it, though, can I? Shipwright. 460. Well, I can actually probably sell my fishing rods, can I? We need to do a bit more fishing to be able to afford that. But if I just pick up my crab pots...
And then I can repair them. Fish. I wonder can these drop fancy version of mackerel or just do these just drop normal mackerel? Seem to just drop normal mackerel, but I need to get a few more. Any crabs in the pot? No, that one needs repair, so we can pick you up. Can't pick up any of those flounders. Pick up one or two of you, though. Well, that's as much as I can pick up. Go back, repair the crab pots, put them back down, and then sell my crap, and hopefully that'll get me enough. I don't think it will, though. I wonder what the speed run is for this game. Well, I can't sell. But I can store. Hmm. Flexible fishing rod, coastal and shallow. I just want dock. Drop the crab pots. I may as well just drop them all close. It's pointless putting them any further, isn't it? Just keep them all in close. I don't think it makes any difference. Hopefully I'll be able to sell stuff once I... Change... Fast forward the time of it. Pursuits, search for relics, two lumber, two scrap, encyclopedia, map. Blackstone oil. What's over there? And why is that marked? Is the fishmongers open? No. I can't get the nice fishing rod that I want. Go back into the map. We'll go up here. Which, that is directly north, isn't it? Yes, cool. And I might find another mackerel deposit thing that maybe might drop the fancy mackerel that I'm looking for. It's about a very calming game and a very stressful game, and I imagine it just gets more stressful and stressful. Disturbed water. No, I assume that that... Let's see. Oh, an all-seeing cod. Well, I caught a new type of fish. Oh, I think I've figured out how to store them anyway. Yeah, look at that. That's what you call efficiency. Okay, that's their resources that I can't collect because I don't have the thing. I need the... whatever the one is. The brown one. The brown type of rod. Oh, what is this? A many-eyed mackerel. Just those little noise cues, just... Ah... Oh. They're just not nice. Give me the tiger mackerel. Oh wait, I can still fish one more. No. There might be something over there. Can I rest here? Can I rest at every dock or is it only certain docks? I can't. Steel point. Material pile. This is an where a builder 
Ah, well, I need the materials anyway. But I can rest, which is nice. Which now means I can go back to the island and sell some stuff. My crab pots will probably be full as well. And... Oh, wait, no, I probably can't sell anything. My inventory is just going to get stuffed up. Which I do not like. So is anybody interested in... Uh... The Outer Wilds on the, on the Switch. I've been meaning to play that game. But it's just a game I've, I haven't gotten around to playing it. And I wonder if the Switch version is actually going to be good. I know it's a pretty slow-paced game, isn't it? So I don't really think it would make too much of a difference. I bought it. I think I own it on Steam. I think I bought it for like €8 Euro or something on sale. Fishmonger, are you open? Ah, yes. I should probably keep them, should I? I really don't know. Ah, oh, feck it, I sold them anyway. Rot. Oh no, I've all my... F well. Turns out if you leave fish in storage, they rot. That's always good, isn't it? That means I think I'm like $20 away from being able to buy that, that cool fishing rod. No, $40. Feck. Give me some good crabs. No. Just getting a little small, boys. I find the clicking between menus kind of a bit... I don't know. It just doesn't feel right clicking in left or right analog stick to change menus. Sell, sell, sell. I have seen that light. I want nothing to do with it. Okay, well, I should be able to just go out for one more little... One more little trawl about here. Maybe get two sharks. Drop the old crab pots. And just go over and catch some crabs. Or crabs, sharks. I think if I catch the sharks, we'll be fine. I should bring me up to, to the money anyway. This looks like there's not that much in it, though. Yeah. Ooh, a bloodskin shark. Cool. So another type of shark. Added to the collection. You look like a mackerel deposit. No, you're not, but... I'm pressing fucking X instead of square. Let me maximize the space again. And back we go. If I just catch a couple of mackerel, that should bring me up to the rod that I want. Then I can actually start going out and... Maybe actually doing something that isn't just catching fish in the, in the starting water. I don't have the shallow thing. But I will now. So I assume when they're flashing, that means they have stuff in them. Yes. I wonder if I should... See, I can't even hold on to them sharks and stuff, so... I thought maybe you could hold on to the fancy fish and then maybe sell them later, but... They just turned to rot. 
Yahoo, I have enough money. Oh, God, that would solve for a lot. 220 for that shark. Ooh, that's nice. So now we can sell you and equip you. There we go. Nice. Okay, so now we have a nice, the nice rod. We have a nice rod. Pursuits. Lumber and scrap. Search for relics. Catch a tiger mackerel. Okay, well, the tiger mackerel is our next goal. I want to see what that creepy hooded fecker has has to say for himself when I give him a... Ten of it's that, like, weird googly-eyed one that I had. He will, uh... He'll want that one, and I'll have to go catch another one. I wonder as much of it up to chance. Oh, I can go first person. Nice. Well, let's go around the back. Because well, there might be something cool back here. Or something extremely creepy. But we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Uh, you are just eels, aren't you? Yeah. Nothing too fancy. Just a grey eel. Can I pick you up? All that's left of the boat is an old husky. Put a little crow. Look inside. Oh, yes! I'll take that. Because I assume that ring... Oh, wait, no. The ring is what that guy's looking for, isn't it? The weird collector dude. And some lumber. Which is exactly what I need right now upgrade. You're just flounders. Yup. Oh, a riddled flounder. Ew. That is... Ew. That is not a nice phrase, is it? Riddled flounder. <laughs> I can't even store them, can I? I probably can, yes. Yeah, I could just move it this way. Move it over here. Pop you there. Lovely. The stone hums quietly, sending ripples through the air. It doesn't respond to my touch. What is that? See, I assume I'm just going to get blue mackerel here, will I? Give it one more go. Yeah. Uh, discard. Something else out making noise. Oh, just dolphins. Cool. Don't mind dolphins. Dolphins aren't... Oh, start dredging. I can dredge. <gasps> yes. Okay, that's exactly what I want. Here's me thinking I needed all the fancy shit to start dredging and I already had it. That's good. Well, I can start dredging. I just need to store some stuff now because I'm full. I'm full up. There's more wood I can collect as well, which is nice. So we just go back and you know, I'll turn off my light. I don't need my light on. Tread the needle here too. Sell you, sell, 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 sell. Now that old chain. I think I know who would want that. And I think I know who would want that as well. But dry dock. So I have lumber. Do I need to store it? Is that what happens? Do storage. Do storage. Uh, I think I know 
who will want that too. It also means that I can do some research with that. There, we'll improve the engine. So does that mean my engine is just done? Improved outboard engine? Or does that mean I need to buy more engines? Ah, I see. Modifies two cargo spaces. Modifies four rod spaces to alter hold nets. Modifies two cargo spaces to hold engines. Okay, so I don't need the rod ones right now, do I? No. But we know what... I think I have a better idea of what I'm actually doing here now. So I know where I need to go anyway, which is, which is good. So I can probably... Add both of these to cargo. And then rest. And then I have a couple of different islands that I need to go exploring. I just don't think I'll be able to do them all in one night. But we'll have to see. So I think if I go to the, the one over here on the right with the little researcher guy. I'll be able to give him that ring. Because that's probably what he's looking for. can also start trawling for some of this crap or dredging okay okay I, okay i see what i need to do oh my god depleted okay so i can only dredge once so anytime i see something that can be dredged i need to do it Okay, this guy either wants that antique... Maybe it's it's all the other island? Let's see. Ruined mansion. What is it? Uh. Okay, so he, he only wants fancy shit. It's a guy over here that wants a bar and stuff. I see. I still need to get a fucking mackerel. I don't think I'm still unsure on if I can catch mackerel in them pools or am I looking for something completely different more wood okay so the wood takes up quite a bit of space in your inventory But I, I think I, that island over there, I think that needs tree wood. If I remember correctly. Painter, what does the painter want? Ah, the fisherman, I thought you might stop by. Look for a humble studio. What sort of decoration? I can attach flags, buttons. Okay, cool. Find any others? Cool. So you want the strange crab. Sell. Sell. And sell. 25. And now we can rest for the day. Oh, a grieving father. I need to look out for those little quests. Well, yes, see, my son was only lost to see in some years. He's still out there, somewhere in those wrecks, all alone in the Kaldak ward. The man is clearly trying as hard as to remain composed, but tremors of grief... I was wondering, I honestly have some dredging equipment installed on your vessel. If you're able to retrieve any of the belongings from the wreck, I think you'd feel more at peace if his mementos were with me. He wore a bronze belt buckle, specially engraved. I'd recognize it anywhere. If there's a chance you could find it, I'd be in your debt. Thank you. Okay, so I can rest now. I was wondering why there was no music. I thought something creepy was going to happen. <laughs> this is going to be me like the whole time I'm playing this game. 
be like, oh, something creepy's gonna happen. Nothing, absolutely nothing's gonna actually happen. Okay, mackerel. Give me something that isn't a blue mackerel, please. Please. That's all I'm asking for. No, more blue feckin' mackerel. Who needs blue mackerel? I actually think you can catch... Uh, well, I have caught mackerel off the coast of Ireland before. I don't know what when mackerel season is, but... You can certainly catch it. And mackerel's actually very nice. I'm not really usually into sort of like fishy fish. I know that's a weird sentence to say. But I like my fish to be not very fishy. Material pile. How much wood? Okay, two wood is what I need. And I also... What, what is that? Is that like stone metal scraps? Okay, well I need to figure out where to find them. I'm kind of stuffed up here though. Is that... This looks like metal. Shapes in the deep. Let's see. I'm so MLG at all these quick time events. Oh, no! <laughs> A bolt of cloth. Well, that cloth probably useful, but... Not what I need right now. And you are... Are you wood? You are. This looks like a shipwreck, though. This looks like more than... What's this? Ah, metal scraps. Look. Okay, so my boat can reverse. I'm not sure if boats can... Can boats reverse? I really don't know. I've never driven a boat or sailed a boat. Never driven a car either, so. I don't think boats can reverse. Material pile. I'll just rest up. I don't want to go out. I don't even want to go five foot from a dock while it's still dark out. Yeah, we just back it up. Beep, 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 beep. And around we go. Get more metal scraps. It's actually probably not even worth my while keeping all this mackerel, is it? No. Just gonna discard it and get... The mackerel isn't worth much. I can literally just ca catch that very easily. So we'll just get a couple of, like, these resources... As many as I can get. And then I'll store them there and then bring them back to the ship upgrading person. Well, I can't get any more than that. So It's the wood that's taking up so much room. That seems to be the easiest one, the, the easiest material to find as well. Goblet. Well, this is this done now. I don't know what this is gonna add. Material pile. I should have had the builder now. Okay, we'll do. I think I want to get this. Cloth scraps or whatever they are. They don't take up much room. So I'll be able to get quite a few. Oh. Please. Be able to get one more. Uh, these wooden or these uh, metal things as well. cool that's good to, to know that that drops that
Okay, I'll, I'll rest up at this dock and then I'll go back. Then that's one more quest done for them. And I'll have some crap to deposit at the upgrading person, Majigger. Don't know what I'll want to upgrade, but we'll just rest. Back to the back to the main base now. My inventory is stuffed up, so pointless capturing or capture. I keep saying capture. Oh boy! Even on the Pokemon streaming, I've never said capture for Pokemon. I wonder what this game looks like on the Switch. Say the OLED. Makes it pop big time. Oh, we got a big boy crab there. That's good. We'll actually just store you for now. We don't... Did I not have wood... In the storage? Or did I bring that with me? I must have brought it with me. Okay, engine. I don't really think I need engine spaces. Or maybe I do. Let's see. New hole. Four new cargo. Oh, that's what I need. Four new cargo spaces. Big time. The cargo spaces are going to save me. Improved 15 knots. Can I buy that? That's only 200. Cool. Peculiar engine. So I can't sell that. So that's obviously... Telling me to keep that. So I'll just pop that in storage. And this also means that I can do this. I can buy two of these boys, can I? Well, I can only buy one. Okay. Pick up the cargo. Okay, the menus are a bit clunky. I'll give it that. The menus are, well, not give it that. I'll take that away from it. Sure, like, I'm sure I'll get used to it, but still. Certainly still clunky enough. Oceanic, coastal, shallow, and then oceanic. Okay. Hmm. Builder. You've done it. Well, no sense of wasting. Let's get moving. Oh, so now I have to... Oh, <laughs> you go in my inventory. There you go. It's like in Majora's Mask when you, uh... When you used to pick, or when you picked up the Deku princess in the fucking find the belt buckle. When you picked up the Deku princess in the in the bottle, that cracked me up when I was a kid. Come, Doc. I should have taken that goblet with me, shouldn't I? That would have made sense. I could have sold it. Now, let's see what this builder person wants. Builder, yes. will do, thank you, fella. Give me a short while. To get things built here, you're welcome back anytime. Aha, yes. 
Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, eventually I'll get the hang of that. Click and it just doesn't feel right. May as well catch some fish. Maybe make a bit of money on my way back. I could go to a different island, couldn't I? I could. Let's go. Let's see what's over here. Hopefully nothing creepy. That's another boat. Oh, that's another boat. That's all dredging stuff. What are you? you pull alongside a boat. <clears throat> I'm supposed to be delivering this package to Little Marrow, but I'm being stalked. A huge Leviathan lurks in these deep waters. Oh, no, no, no. Where is Little Marrow? Mm. No, I don't like that. I don't like that. Sam, I am. Okay, well, I know where Little Marrow is. So that means I'm going to do some dredging. I don't like that the music is stopped. That's... That does not feel good. Okay, okay, okay. We'll just go, 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 go. See, now it just makes it 50 times creepier. Okay, well, there's the dolphins. Oh, no, they're not dolphins. They're orcas. Oh, that's deadly. I thought they were, like, giant dolphins. Well, I guess orcas are kind of just giant dolphins, I guess. But that's nice. They don't scare me, at least, even though they could literally chop my boat in half in an instant if they really wanted to. But they didn't. They're nice. Might as well make the most of my uh, trip out here. Just keep dredging, just keep dredging, just keep dredging, dredging, dredging. Thank you. More metal scraps. Okay. Oh crap, I won't be able to see the feckin' rocks. Okay, I can see the rocks. Oh yeah, the lighthouse there. Good. Literally makes me do. Well, then can I just play this game without ever having to get in danger if I just play it like really safe? Okay, who wants this package? Oh no, I need to go to the little place, whatever it was called. My storage. Storage, 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 storage. So I have three more of them. I'll take the goblet actually. Let's actually see, what do we have? Dry dock. Light space. Raw, I think rod space is probably a good, a good show. Need more wood for it, but. It does also mean that we can do a bit more research. A heat resistance rod or anti tangle rod. But if I just upgrade it all, find outboard engine, twin prop. This engine outfitted with a dual propeller system, increasing speed. So that's a four block, is it? I have three parts. Let's do it.
in twin prop engine get up there how much does it cost a crafter that's a real question 450 and how much do i get if i sell i got a hundred for that okay how many fish to sell no but i can go to the goblet now anyway stream is running fine yes good okay yeah, so this guy wants that weird weird creepy package does he want this Dock worker. Oh no, I need to speak to the dock worker. How's the day treating you? I've got a package for you. Yeah, fecker, you didn't, you didn't pay me. You fecker. Okay, well I need a fair bit more money. I also need more wood as well. These flounders just... I mean, it's hardly even worth catching these yokes. They just take up so much room. These are caught, are they? I won't have any room for them either. I have a small bit of room for some mackerel. So I just need to make up a small bit of money here. Yup. So I assume that's all chance then, is it? I have a couple of crabs to sell as well. Might go for a bit of money, hopefully. One of these is big as well. Need to sell some stuff though before I. Oh, nice! Trophy earned. Have a full cargo. Well, that's surprising. Oh, it's because yeah, it's because I guess I didn't have the the one spaces filled. Sell, sell, sell. Jesus, it's not. It's not even worth it, is it? They just they just don't sell for anything. I don't even think this big crab is going to sell for much, will it? I don't think it will. Ah, 32, that is nothing. How much is that, uh, that new engine I'm looking for? 450. Okay. Oh, wait, crap. Let me dock again. We'll rest, and I'll go over to the island with the builder. Maybe she will have set up shop. See what she's, uh... See what she's, uh, doing over there. I'll hopefully be able to pick up some fish on the way. I think the sharks are probably the only ones worth feckin' fishing for, are they? All these other yolks aren't worth anything is this wood over here it is oh, it's depleted already well I only need one of one wood I think
Still, the hell they jiggle is just so funny. Shark jiggle physics. <laughs> okay, let's farm some mackerel again. Still wait to see if I can get a tiger mackerel. Completely unsure on if that's even how this game works, but... There is only one way to find out. There we go. The shark are actually worth doing. Okay. Dry dock. And I can store the wood. I mean, that doesn't really actually change anything, does it? However, I have enough for the new Yoki Majig, which means I can go extra fast. Means I can put you on storage. That's 36. Nice. Stall you. Okay. Uh, I mean, I can't really go anywhere. I have to... Go to the res... Or have to rest. And I'll go where I need to go. I'm not missing anything, am I? Pursuits. No. Find the bell buckle near Little Marrow. Search for relics. Capture tiger mark. Okay, let's go over to... Uh... Oh, yeah. There's a big, big difference in the speed. Big, big difference. Means I can actually start exploring some crap, probably. Maybe, hopefully. They're just raw materials, resources that I don't need right now. I think I'll actually explore over around this island now. See what see what we can't find as as the Americans would say. Like a nice calf she has built here on the side of this mountain. Okay, so now I have storage here. Is storage shared, I wonder? That would be very handy if it was, but it also sounds like a game that wouldn't have that, you know? Seems a bit more hardcore. There's a boat over there. There was something over there that went into the water. That looked like a massive angler fish. I don't like that. I do not like that, Sam. I am. I do not like that green eggs and ham. Now, let's see if we can find a tiger mackerel around here. Well, you're just flounders. Oh, you're not flounders. Nice. Stingray. Cool. Uh, what's the best way to store a stingray? Jeez, they are all... I won't... No, it's pointless me even trying to cap... Ooh. Hmm. There has to be a way that I can, uh, I can move things around here, hasn't there? Yeah. Should allow me to store him now. Yep, cool. Not like I could store anything else. SOS. Good job you have me coming over to help you. I washed up here some two weeks ago. I thought my crew would have come. No. The boy saying, no, they didn't. Oh, well, I'm sure they're out. Look, can you get me to Little Marrow? I don't have any room for you, though. My, my uh, cargo is more precious. I'll be back, though. Don't worry. Don't you worry. That's just wood, isn't it? Yeah. Uh... 
And what's this over here? This looks like something that I can inspect. Yep. Oh, look at all this stuff. Pick up. Pick up. Uh, do I have any room? I have room for you anyway. Cool. But I know where there's more scrap if I need it. Some more stingrays, is it? Yep. I think I got pretty lucky by capturing the... Catching the, uh, the fancy one. So quickly. Hopefully this will uh, give me a bit of money. I wonder does this game track your days? Seems like a game that would. Only 73? Mm. Plan storage. Storage, storage, and then I'll keep you. I mean, I may as well rest because I won't be able to go anywhere. I wonder how big your inventory can get because I'm hoping, like, at some point I'll be able to take, like, six of them stingrays or something instead of only being able to carry one or two. wonder if your boat gets much bigger than that. Okay, let's go save this fucker over here. I mean, he might be dead. I don't know. That would actually be pretty cool. If that was like a once, a once off guy. Oh, what's over here? Something is shimmering in the water. Again, I think someday I'll, I'll, I'll get enticed by something shimmering in the water. And it won't be good. Now remember. Oh, feck. I figured out how to store them properly, didn't I? Ah, I remember. It was like this, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. Aha, there we go. Give me the big boy. Ooh. I know what I can do. I can grab you. Pop you down here. There we go. Jeez, I've streamed this for two hours. That does not feel like two hours. I'm having a lot of fun. There is something about these sort of, uh, I don't know, would you call this like a survival game? You know, games that have sort of, uh, you know, Minecraft-like or Terraria-like mechanics where it's, you're slowly moving out from your base to get new gear and you're finding resources. I'd say they're sort of Minecraft-y kind of stuff. Oh no, oh no, I will be able to take it. There's just something like about these types of games where you just lose yourself. And, well, when they're done right, I think there's certain ones that are, I, I honestly think as much as I did enjoy playing Valheim, I more enjoyed it because, like, I was playing it with my cousin, and, I mean, most games we play, regardless of how bad they are, we have fun. But, like, a lot of them, a lot of them games are kind of very slow and borderline unrewarding. But when they're done right, like Minecraft or Terraria, where there's just, they just always constantly give you that one last, you know, oh, if I just explore this cave, I'll get the next item. Or if I just fight this boss, or if I, and I think Valheim took too long in between the, the big payouts for me. And also the game felt clunky, so sometimes stuff didn't feel like it was, it was your fault, you know. There you go, returns for someone to save. Oh, it's good luck. Well, that's staying in my inventory. How much does the ring sell for? 90. But I wonder, does it actually give me good luck? I don't know. I'll be able to make it back without dying, hopefully. I mean, I'm right there. So hopefully I won't die. <laughs>
The lights have turned on. Okay, we're, we're building up. We're building up a good reserve of money. Heat resistant line. Shallow does that. Let's see. Again, inventory is kind of oceanic. Okay. Trying to think here. I don't really care about that. What about the dry dock? Do I need... Do I need to get all four? To be able to? Yes, I think I do. Okay, well, I think I should start working on that then next. I thought it was almost like a mix and match thing. I can kind of choose what I want. That isn't the case. I need two cloth for this, which I have. Okay. But still, I still need more money. Cool. So I need three woods. Now to find the wood is the real question. Because it seems to be relatively hard to find. I mean, I need all of them because eventually the next upgrade. I want to go explore this island over here though, first. See if there's anything else cool that I can find. I don't want to, oh look at how deep that water is out there. No, I don't like it. These are caught, aren't they? Yeah. It... Dolphins, kill! I don't mind the dolphins, and I don't like, and I don't mind the orcas. But eventually, there's gonna be oh, swordfish. So I won't even have enough room for these, will I? These feckers look like they'll take up a lot of inventory space. Yes. I just about have room for one. Sailfish. Okay, well, I should be able to at least do a loop of this island. Oh, I don't like it. I do not like it. Whatsoever. It's like when, when I'm near when I'm near land, it's like, okay, this isn't too bad. It doesn't respond. That's the second bit of stone. That has had something like that. I might find something in this. Something useful. A plate. Ah, yes. My favourite thing to... A turtle! Go! Cool. A tortoise. No, that's a turtle, sorry. Oh, there's some weird noises starting to happen. I think it's just my boat. I think that's all it is. Okay, let's actually see if the storage is... Yeah, that was just my boat making the noise. Let's see if the storage is, is shared. Because that would make a massive difference. Oh, storage is shared, yes! The only problem is that fish isn't going to be fresh when I sell it now. Yeah, it's probably going to say... Yeah, like the fish is stale. Who the feck had one stale fish? It sounds borderline illegal just to even feckin' sell it here, man. But can't imagine there's many uh, regulations back in 1928. Especially in a, a game as well. I think I'm thinking about it a bit too deep. Okay, don't crash into the rocks while you're trying to make sure the stream is up and running fine. Good, I didn't. Okay, let's see how much I get for this swordfish. Or sailfish, I think it was called. Oh, 
Let us see. Fishmongers. Okay, we just add you to storage, and I'll probably rest. I am doing a lot of resting, but I just don't want to be caught out in the cold, or in the... Well, in the cold as well, but... In the darkness is the, uh... It's the thing I'm worried about. I'm not equipped for the darkness yet. <laughs> See, I kind of want to. I, I kind of want to figure out what happens when I go out very far. So let's choose a place and go. Let's go all the way out here. It's a nice day. The clouds are... Not many clouds. The water is nice and calm. However, the water is also very deep. There's a shipwreck over here. See, it's when the music stops. It just... Oh my god, I don't know why. It just makes my feckin' skin crawl. Please tell me that they are. Oh no. Hearing a lot of noises. Red snapper. Cool. I seriously cannot deal with this. Crap, it's gonna get dark soon. Feck. I don't think I'll be able to bank it back on time. Ah, feck it. Just keep going. Ooh. No. I thought I'd be brave, but I'm already bottling it. Actually, do you know what? Feck it. I want to see what that red light is behind the island. I'm being brave. I'm being brave. If I get eaten by something, I get eaten by something. See, now there's all these creepy noises. The problem is with streaming, I have to keep on the headphones. Is this the red thing that I was looking for? Oh, this looks like a fancy key of some description. Is that, was that the red light? The problem is you seriously cannot see a feckin' thing. My hole is damaged. Like, stop making noises. Feck off, game. Oh! Jesus, you really cannot see a feckin' thing. Oh my god. How can this game be so fucking creepy? No. Okay, I'm back. I'm relatively safe. Jesus Christ. This game is scary. Oh! This is... Now, I do think Subnautica, like... Now, Subnautica is genuinely a terrifying game. Uh, obviously, that's in first person, so it's going to be scarier, but this does similar things with, with the atmosphere. This is certainly not walk in the park either. So I have that key. I wonder, was that the, the, the light that was going off in the back? I wonder. So we give the key to your man. And then the next item on the list is to actually upgrade my ship properly. With the research stuff, or the, the shipyard, dry dock. That's the word I'm looking for. Okay, there, you can have the book. 
a heart. Give me the book, please. Thank you. No one to talk to. Cool. Let's see. Are my books? Resilience to panic. What happens when you start panicking? Like, I mean, I start panicking in real life. But what happens when you actually start panicking in the game? Okay, let's see. Let's see what happens when I give this guy this. A little trophy here. Deliver the key. You hand him the key. The cold metal shimmers a strange shine as he holds it. The shape of the key, the teeth. The head now somehow seemed changed smaller. as always been this way. Is this it? Where's the lock? The collector grows agitated. Seems to peace for a good trap. Much for a suspect. In that case, allow me to aid your travels. Oh, otherworldly speed at a price. What does that mean? What's the price? <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. Haste adds speed to your engines, but, incre but increases panic and engine heat. Hold L1. See how much faster I can go. Okay, it gives you... Okay. Fair bit of heat. Okay, well, this game has gripped me by the balls. I have to say, this game, fantastic. Dredge, I'm really enjoying it. I will definitely be playing more. I I don't know how long. Let's see, what's how long to beat on this game? How long to beat Dredge? Nine hours. Uh, I mean, that probably means it'll be about 20 hours for me, considering how slow I'm going. But that's fine. Uh, I think I will leave it there, though. I'll, wait, what's this? She walks towards the dock, confused, look at her face. Oh, it's you. Who are you expecting your engine? It sounds like, I'm sorry, I missed the cover of the vessel of my old friend. Dejected, she turns and walks back to the lighthouse. Okay, well, she doesn't care about me. But yeah, I'll leave the stream there. I do usually only stream for two hours, so I appreciate everybody watching. I might have a review for this. I'm not sure. I'll, you know, I want to play more sort of indie games that are kind of up there for game of the year and just you know see what they're like so yes i really appreciate everybody watching i will have a let me see potentially a ps portal video out soon enough if mine arrives or if i can get one should i say and uh other than that yeah see you all in the next video or stream goodbye